evening, gentlemen. I am your host, Dr. Earthworm Robotnik. And I'm Moon Eagle, the challenger. And we have a co-commentator with us today. Hi guys, it's Cat. And we are doing a rematch of Guilty Gear because he wiped the floor with me. Yeah, and it was my first time playing too. Let's see, I got this this time. Use Kai Let's see. I uh, set it to, yeah, new time. Because that's like the Soul vs. Kai theme. music in this game. It's ah. metal. It's not just simply metal, it's just every form of rock. Oh, what is my TV remote? Here we go. So what's the deal with Kai anyway? Is he like... Kai's a police officer. And that he and Soul were part of the Holy Knights during the war against the Gears. Nice. It was led by Cliff. There was, it was just more of a name, though. They were just trying to kill off the Gears as the main goal, because the yeah. Gears were trying to kill everyone. Ride the lightning, bitch! Huh. You beat me. I think the tables have turned this time in my favor. And I meant that as in, like, it's reverse, like... Yeah. Like, I'm getting my butt kicked. Oh. Okay, here we go. Rising for... Ah, oh, come on! No, I don't get to use overdrives. Damn it! Combo breaker! Oh, I ended it wrong. We'll probably do Street Fighter 4 after this. Oh, uh, heck yeah. Sounds fun. We'll have the Ultra version just because Street Fighter 5 is coming out, so I bought just to anticipate. Yeah. Let's rock! Yeah, 2 had the most iterations. Yeah, I'm not gonna debate that. <laughs> Yeah, to but be fair, was it, was it because of software stuff? To be fair, like you couldn't just simply patch up a game like you can nowadays. So back then, you had to remake the whole game. Well, to be fair, with arcade machines, all you had to do was just install the hardware. Like it's not that crazy. Like you could just simply install a new board as long as it had the proper hardware. Ooh. Say something here, okay, where did I put my pen? Oh, there you go. I Let's see, don't know much about technology. Let's see. I know how to turn a phone off to do not disturb and that's it. Let's see. So, this is a bit of a difference and uh, just set a time. Whatever, really. Hell, Michigan. <laughs> Hell, Michigan. If, I mean, if, if, you don't, if, you don't get, if you don't get the joke, Cat, there's actually a city in Michigan literally named Hell. Oh, really? And look, we got like the most cool. cheery song in Hell! Hey, the hell! Da -da. Well, um, um, feel, feel my wrath of Eddie! Because that's how I feel. Eddie was like OP and reload, oh, from what I've heard. Is Eddie blind or something? Uh, Zato is, like, his actual name is Zato One, but in this game he's dead, and the, Eddie's the name of the parasite. So, yeah, you're all right. He had to sacrifice, like, Zato One to actually control Eddie, he had to sacrifice his eyesight. Oh, crap, I missed! Ooh. The question is, if the city's called Hell, does it freeze over? Maybe it's just a, simply just a different version. This is probably not the actual hell, but it's just more of an area. Because, like, like the world. Oh, it, yeah, it freezes over. It freezes over. Ironic. I guess you say this fight is. I'm trying to do something. Okay, I'm just kind of button mashing with Eddie right here. I mean, I know how to use them somewhat. Yeah, I'll say. But I've only been using them for about a day, though. Let's see. Ah, oh, crap. I meant to play. Come on, play some. Play. Oh, I mean to. Keep. 
Desperation attack! Ah, oh, I used my... I was about to use a desperation attack on you. <laughs> oh, hang on. There we go. Set the center right a little bit. That's another it was a little off. I would really want to switch to direct capture, but I just can't afford it at the moment. Well, I do, though, I will probably do streaming, too. Yeah. Let's see. What the? No, I, I don't want to use my instant kill. By the way, how do you do instant kills anyway? You push all the attack buttons, and then you do like a quarter, two quarter circles and the high slash, but really they're not worth it. Like, they're awesome if you can pull them off. One for me. Like, you never see them used in tournaments, I should mention that. Oh, yeah. I, mean, I, actually, I actually found footage of us in a tournament. Oh, yeah, yeah the Smash tournament we entered. Yeah. Let's see. Hey, guys. Alright. After this, can we maybe get something to drink? Uh, sure. sure. Let's see. After we do five matches, whoever wins five. That was awesome. <laughs> I have a ship anchor. Uh, I think that would be something. That, I think something that you would do, Cat, if you were in this game, like you fight with an anchor. <laughs> well, this like, that's like 700 pounds. Like Wait, I what? said. Like an anchor would be like 700 pounds, I think. I guess I would be the anchor woman in this fight. Yeah. Oh, I get it. I got it. to make a lot of puns. Anchorman, resident Ron Burgundy. What did the, what did the pirates say to the optometrist? Aye, aye, Captain. Huh. Mark on the 11-year-old getting the pirate movie. Because it was rated R. <laughs> Get back to work, Squidward. I'm not paying you to do stand-up comedy. <laughs> yeah. I don't get it. And it was, that was a SpongeBob reference. Oh. Ah yeah. oh, man, SpongeBob. Back. That was like back one of the eight shows. I always wanted though. to eat a Krabby Patty. <clears throat> yep. So, uh, but yeah. What is I, the I, formula? I really hope that the show ended after the after the second movie. I heard if it didn't, though, Steven Hillenburg might work on it again, though. Yeah. Really, though, I think it's just. Spongebob would still be making crap. And guess what? And guess what? That's Family me. Guy is going to make right. even more episodes. Seth MacFarlane himself actually said he would I like to end it sometime soon. From what I've heard. Also, Emilio Rage. Hiatus and. So I'll do that for nothing for return. show, Gravity Falls, is almost over. Oh yeah, yeah, I heard it's about to end. Soon. I'm probably gonna be crying during the whole last episode. Hang on. What exactly is this stage? Uh, it's like the lair of that man. Okay, here we go. It's really cool. I love the lightning. That's all I can say. I don't know about this fighting game. Let's see, come on! Oh, you want to know something that we have to do in the future? What? You know those Nerf video games that... that oh, I, those that games? I, why don't we play those? As like a joke or something. Yeah, I, could go, I think I, we could do better for like a joke Let's Play, dude. Oh god. Are we talking about that one game? Yes. The Cat in the Hat video game. I actually that, like that. To be fair, like compared to other licensed games I played, super effective. At least that one was functional. Yeah, it was functional, but it's just a boring. Cur it's like a boring, more boring version of Clonoa. No. Yeah, but but at least it doesn't compare to the game that my sister got for the GameCube. Oh, once. that brat, that crappy Bratz game, that Kenny. Caddy, yeah. Caddy actually reviewed that game. Yeah, and and you know what the funny thing is? What? My sister didn't even play the game. She only played it like once on Christmas, and then she never touched it again. <laughs> That's just like what the hell is the point of even getting a game if you're not gonna play it? Some games, at least, I that I've never touched that after that one initial, at least kind of looked cool to me. Well, like like Snake Eater, not just because I saw the DSP play, I thought. 
If I get this and play it on my first time, I can probably do better, but the absurd length of the cutscenes in that game just kind of turned me away. Which is kind of funny, because I actually love the original PlayStation game, though. I mean, maybe if I were to play it again, maybe I would probably get into it. But, eh, who knows. Let's see. Winger, named after one of them. It's Beavis and Butthead. Be also, Beavis and Butthead's least favorite band. Let's see. Three. Me, three, you. Let's see. Time to even up the odds. Nice With Dr. Frost. Nice job, Eagle. <laughs> you, you knocked him dead. Yeah, Bloodstained Lineage. Leave it at that. That's a good one. This one? I uh, know. The, leave the theme on Bloodstained Lineage. Pick whatever stage, though. So. It's a doctor with a bag over his face. Yeah, to hide his identity, though. But he has two eyes. Yeah. So why not put the second it's eye? It's a design doctor. choice. Okay. Uh, that that I can accept. The doctor is in, folks. The doctor is in. Time to... Can, can I say the joke? No, wait, wait for it. Let's see. Come on. Damn it. Dang. Might walk in the door. I can't get over the attacks with the door. Well, um... It's genius. Well, Dudley and Street Fighter fight with roses. He only tosses that as a talk, though. Oh. It's a good thing I brought my rose over today. Let's see, come on. Oh, yes! Oh, come on! I was about to get the. I was about to show the scalp of your ass! Give you a prostate exam! With the scaffold! <laughs> oh, gross. This rose and I'm, smells good. And pretty. now it's four to. Yeah, four to one. And who's winning? Time for your prostate exam! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to explain this. It was a Smash Brothers okay, post. Okay, me and on him were playing Super Smash Brothers one day and. We happened to get a post that said, with Dr. Mario, where he's like holding a glove and it said, Time for your prostate exam! And now it's and now it's become an inside joke. Yeah. Exam. Also, but we also put a bunch of expand dong memes. Just why? Why did it become popular? Why? It, where did it? I get the joke for expand dong, but why? I shower you with coconut cream. Thought. I remember that I actually watched the Legend of the Crystal Coconut nonstop when I was a kid, it, and I thought it was like one of the best movies ever. I remember when I was like. Yeah, it's uh, it's actually just more of a collection of the Donkey Kong TV show. Yeah, more or less. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, but so you know when he's swimming in the air, he kind of reminds me of Waluigi for some reason. Guys, I just remembered I found this remix of the Donkey Kong rap. Donkey. Yeah, I, like, I have no style. I have no grace. You have a funny I'm gonna, face. I'm gonna slam the door in your face. This guy has a funny face. But like it's a I remember that there was a Steven Universe version of it. Or we found a Chris Chan version of that in the video in the comments where he makes the employee. Yep. He has no style. He has no grace. This idiot's gonna mace you in the face. <laughs> he can make crappy drawings when he needs to. Seriously, this, I, even I can draw better than Wait, wait, wait. This moron just hates blue! CC Christian! Don't even discuss that guy. He's disgusting. Don't call anyone. Damn it! <laughs> you interrupted my attack! I'm just waiting for him to throw that giant scuffle over his butt. 
that's, that's kind of a messed up thing to say, Cat. Man, that's because that, 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 it happens, though. I'm just waiting for him to do that. I know that sounds oh, messed up, no. but I have a messed up brain. That was the best move ever, though. Okay. And XR, he just does, like, the popular Japanese prank, the Kancho. <laughs> Which Naruto fans might recognize that as more of the thousand years of death. I actually watched Naruto. It's pretty It's pretty awesome, but I, I hate the filler episodes. I'm okay with Naruto, but I it's just one of those things that the fan base kind of ruined to me, because I remember when I was, like, in high school. Yeah, I remember when I, when I was in, yeah, same here. I was in elementary school, and I, the first time I ever watched it was when Orochimaru was killing how Sadat to would be oh, so nice. safe. Oh, nice. That's usually Overdrive. Yes! Yes! Oh, time! Oh, that's, the <laughs> that's the coolest move ever. Ew. No, I mean it in a gross way. And you win. Again. Despite my prostate exam of death. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I find that attack so cool. Let's it's see. funny. So, that ends this. And see you guys later. See ya. See ya!